Yeah, that's enough of that. That's, that's enough, enough about that. That's Let's get to the New York enough. Times, Josh. Yeah. Come on. I again. said here last week, mm -hmm. I was taking them to task for a headline after a terrorist attack that a driver was deliberately trying to hit a bus stop. And I said, no, no, he's trying to deliberately hit people to kill people. And they've outdone themselves because there was another terrorist attack over the weekend. And there, this is an interesting story. Because when it first happens, the New York Times website had an article by Reuters that said, uh, Palestinians wielding knives shot dead by police. Okay. Okay, which, which is fair. The Palestinians had attacked the police with knives. I will take that story. That was on the New York Times website. 24 hours later, and you think with time the stories gets more accurate, the New York Times now has their own story, their own byline, and the headline's identical, except they drop the wielding knives part. And it simply said, Israeli police shoot two Palestinian men. Israeli police shoot two Palestinian shoot men. Shoot two Palestinian men. It, it must be the same uh, uh, character over there who writes the headlines. Who's writing who's these doing headlines? doing it over and over but again. I'll tell you, it, it gets worse than that. Worse than that. The New York Times print edition. Millions of people around the world still get the print edition. What was the headline there? Palestinian teenager killed by Israeli police. See, and this is the wow. situation. If you bring that up with the uh, bureau here in Jerusalem, and I've done this before in the years of complaining about coverage, etc. What's the excuse? They'll re they'll say that wasn't my idea. It wasn't it, my title. Me. They'll refer you to the home office over there in in New York. So, I mean, number one, people need to know that that is where the complaint needs to be directed. But you would think perhaps that maybe a journalist here would say, "Hey, you ruined my article, or you you used the wrong title." I mean, no communication. You think that maybe or, Jody or, Rudorin, right. who saw her article trashed with the headline last week, they got long last week. She might have said, "You know, guys, you destroyed the article with the headline last week. Maybe this week have a little accuracy." All we want is you know words like after attacking Israeli police with knives. You know, or they could, for once, and this is rare, I don't know if this ever happens, actually focus on the fact that a uh, Palestinian terrorist tries to murder three Israeli policemen. I mean, that looks like a logical Attempted headline. terrorist attack. Attempted attack, something like that, but that, of course... What were the know. police supposed to do anywhere in the world? You attack a policeman with a knife. Mm -hmm. And nobody's debating what happened. You attack a policeman with a knife, you're going to get shot. The policeman's going to defend his life. If I attack you with a knife, I hope you shoot me. <laughs> I won't do that, don't worry. All right, I won't shoot you either. But um, all right, so that's New York oh, Times. Oh, man, again. That's, that's bad. Add it again. Anybody and, else? Uh, 